So let's talk about the developer access token in Dialogflow. We already looked at the client access token and the developer access token is also a key which is used to make API calls and the important thing about the developer access token is that it is very powerful. As a result, you should never expose the token to untrusted parties. Now, I already mentioned that it has much greater permissions than the client access token and what this means is you can use the developer access token to create and update and delete intents and entities. So in other words, you can modify your chatbot pretty much any way you want using your developer access token uh, in a programmatic way that is. And the other thing that is worth noting is that the developer access token is a proper superset of the client access token. So anything you can do, any API call you can make with the client access token, you can also do that with the developer access token. So in the dialog flow console, you can just take a look at the settings and under the general tab, you'll see the developer access token over there.